all the school was in the playground having a wonderful time. We all thought we were going out for a day trip. All the boys put this mask on and oh, running around like little pigs. <laughs> like that. Think I'm a little pig. As they start out on what to them is the great adventure, already German troops, guns and planes have crossed the Polish border. We were told to bring in some shoes, and knickers and vest. We were all laughing and joking and thinking how wonderful this is. Then the coach came in the playground and off we went on this coach. We were told to sing because this is a good day. And we're all singing, we are the Camberwell girls. And I'm sitting there on this, on this coach and I happened to look out and just wave it to my mum and I saw she was crying. I said, what's she crying for? Why is she crying? I didn't dream that we weren't coming back that night. I really thought that it was just a day out. So it's goodbye to the cities and danger areas, labelled and loaded and not forgetting their gas masks. The children head for the special train, and they're not worrying, they're off on a holiday. I fell asleep, and my sister nudged me, she said, wake up, wake up, we're there, where? And I looked out and I could see green fields, I thought it was gorgeous, like something I'd seen in books. It was the first time I'd been out, out of London, and we all queued up, and we walked up a hill to what I thought was a, a big house. The income, all these country folk and started picking us off one by one. I'll take that one. What's this all about? What, why, are they, why are these people taking us? She kicked the door open, she said, this is yours. It was a basement door. And there was little, three little bars on the window. She said, outside there is a toilet. She said, and that's your bed. A mattress on the floor, just a mattress, no pillows. Right, now, she said, I want you to clean all that silver. And we, she gave us lots of toasting racks and trays, and we had to clean the silver. My sister kept saying to me, listen, don't cry, don't cry. It was just overwhelming, you know. What could you do? You, you, this is how it was. One day we got back to our billet and in walked my mum. Do you want to come to take you home? Oh, it was like heaven. You come to take us home? I grabbed hold of it and I wouldn't let her go. The world's greatest city writes in flames an epic of courage that stirs the hearts of free men everywhere. Almost within, well, within, certainly within weeks, the blitz started. So it was just too much. It made me stronger, much stronger. So whatever you do, don't moan. Ha, ha, ha.